Good morning, I'm John Perkins with the opening market minute. Soybeans and corn are both showing a little bit of weakness in the early going on Friday, waiting for updated weather outlooks out of South America. Weekly export sales for corn are pretty good, down in the week, but still larger than what some analysts had been expecting. While it was kind of a disappointing week for soybeans, the actual physical shipments for both continue to move out slower than expected as well. Unknown destinations did buy another 125,000 tons of U.S. corn this morning, third sale this week, bringing their total to a little more than a half a million metric tons. Wheat showing a little bit of firmness so far today, seeing commercial support around these price levels while keeping an eye on the U.S. dollar index. Live and feeder cattle are higher ahead of widespread direct cash cattle business this week. That may end up waiting until after this afternoon's USDA cattle on feed report out at 3 o'clock Eastern, 2 o'clock Central. Analysts expect the total number of cattle on feed to be up on the year while placements and marketings could be down. That's at least partially due to there being fewer business days in December 2017 than in December 2016. And hogs are mostly lower on spread trade and demand uncertainties. I'm John Perkins with the Opening Market Minute.